How's it going everyone? Alex Duos here and welcome back to Fallout 4. So, uh, we're pretty much e exactly where we left off last time. Sorry, I thought he wasn't wearing pants. It kind of freaked me out for a Glad second. Glad you signed on. <laughs> Means I might get to take the occasional night off. <laughs> no nights off for you. Hey, Glory. Hey you. So the switchboard was crawling with bad guys. Lines and shit too. Any of that true? Or was Deacon bullshitting me again? I didn't do it alone, but yeah, that's about the size of it. That's hardcore. How'd you take down the old HQ? Please tell me you didn't go along with Deacon's in and out like a ghost crap. Well, we gotta blue shit up. With a whole lot of bullets and a whole lot of blood. <laughs> Fortunately, the blood wasn't mine. That's how you do it. Well, welcome to the party. After what happened to Tommy Whispers, we need another tough son of a bitch that can get shit done. Who's Tommy Whispers? Tommy was a second heavy at HQ. He went KIA after the Institute assholes took out the switchboard. With him gone, I've been running missions nonstop. So I'm damn happy you're here. They call me Glory, the Angel of Death, the ass-kicking poster child of a liberated synth. You really are a synth, right? You weren't pulling my leg before. That's what the maid in the Institute stamp on my ass says. Synths are androids, right? Can you prove you're more than just a machine? Can you prove I'm not? This is like one of Carrington's goddamn tests. Huh. Listen carefully. This statement is a lie. Am I telling the truth? What sort of stupid question is that? Listen. I think for myself. I feel. Like, right now? I'm a little pissed off. <laughs> How do you arrive at a thought? How do your feelings form? I don't know. Something happens and I just... feel something in my gut. Someone hurts a friend and I want to frag them. If I'm working something out, I just build a plan in my head. Step by step. The same way everyone does, I guess. So do you think we're just machines? If we are? Then take a long look in the mirror. Maybe you're just running your brain's goddamn programming. Do you have any doubts you're not just a machine? In the Institute? They screw with your head. Yeah, sometimes. When things are really bleak, I wonder. But then, I remember something. I've been living free for years. And no one out there, not one person, has ever thought I was a synth. I gotta go blow off some steam. Later. Damn. There, there, there's a question where you ask her somehow about uh, she never met a synth sleeping and eating. And she gives you some sort of bingo deep response that kind of answers the question as to whether or not synths need to eat and sleep. And I'm guessing that was my opportunity and I missed it. So either way, fuck me, right? Analyzing. Pam. Processing. Agent. Professor. Your arrival was not calculated. Mm-hmm. That's a strange way to say hello. Temporarily unable to process verbal input. Still processing. Preliminary adjustments to statistical models complete. Commencing introduction. I was, am, and will most likely be Pam. Predictive analytic machine. Do you work for the railroad? Yes. My goals and the railroad organization have a high degree of correlation. They provide data. I provide first order approximations of the behaviors of all residents of the region, designated Commonwealth. Rephrasing I predict the future. Neat. But you didn't predict me coming. That's correct. Caution. Biological life forms behave erratically, unpredictably. All output subject to an extremely high margin of error. Good to know. I urge you to disregard all predictions. Operation complete. You are a rogue variable. 
No current or previous models predict your presence or existence. Query, what is your point of origin? I'm from Vault 111, if that's what you mean. Accessing Vault 111. Cryo Vault. Believed destroyed. Conversation terminated. Pending construction of new probability matrix. Rephrasing. Goodbye. <laughs> Rephrasing. Fuck you. Pam. Solving for theta n when i approaches probability bounds. Okay, yeah, whatever. Uh let's See, how do there, I kick off her? Assume you're being oh. Watched. Yeah, I got to talk to the doctor. Deacon's record is the best. You could learn a lot from him. Deacon can eat shit, all right? That's what I got to say about that. Where it is Diamond City is under opposition control. We're all the sense god. My, anim my, my animosity towards Deacon stems more or less entirely from my machinima making efforts because I needed, uh, you know, bodies with repeatable quests for dialogue. And, uh, you know, I'd, I'd change One their appearances and shit, but Deacon is scripted to remove whatever hair he has and randomly equip a wig. Mr. Which Mona told me to give you this. Fucked up everything. An extraordinary feat to recover this, but that's hardly the point. Without a lick of training and us knowing hardly anything about you, Des has invited you to join HQ. It would have been nice if she had consulted with her second in command, but what's done is done. <sighs> Since you're here now, we might as well put you to work. Okay. Tell me what you need, Doc. One of our field agents, Old Man Stockton, needs help with the runaway synth. H222. So headquarters, as always, puts out the fires that others can't be bothered to put out themselves. The paranoid old bat won't even tell us the problem. He insists that we get our intel from a dead drop. Neat. He may have a good reason to be paranoid. Perhaps he does. And maybe he did the other dozen times he's made our agents jump through these unnecessary hoops. The dead drop is a mailbox with a rail sign on it. It's a common means of communication for us, so keep an eye out for them. When you make contact with Stockton, he won't give you the time of day unless you give him the proper countersign. The current sign is, do you have a Geiger counter? And the counter is, mine is in the shop. Please tell me Deacon taught you that at least. You can trust me with this. I'll get it done. You sound rather convincing, actually. Stockton is a prominent businessman at Bunker Hill. The dead drop will be near there. Use the escape tunnel in the back to get there quicker. Alright, let's go do this shit. We're also still really deep in, uh, you know, the center of things. The city, I mean. So, shit's gonna be a little hairy out there. Yeah, I got plenty of inventory space. I'm good. Might want to flush your system with rad away before your hair falls out. And you might want to eat shit, motherfucker. Take Tom's cooking up something. I hope it goes better than last time. So yeah, I was actually wrong last episode when I said that Tinker Tom was the one I needed to, uh, whose quests I needed to advance to get the Ballistic Weave. He does sell Ballistic Weave gear, but after I've unlocked it via Pam's quests. And I think I need to do this first. Well, I think I need to do this before I can really do anything. So let's get it done. Hacking this is beyond me. And there's nothing in there I need anyways. Unless you... Hey. Nope. Don't you. have time. It's not that I don't have time, I just don't care. Terminal only. You know, given how this quest is going to play out, I kind of wish I'd brought a robot with me. Because, as always, robots are OP. Let me go ahead and mark my quest after all. Whoop. So and you picked the wrong fight. So long. <laughs> oh. We'll be Whoa. Oh, whack. Anyways, we need to go this way. 
the Raiders can. <laughs> the Raiders can get fucked. Come on, Valentine. Bring you and that minigun up here. I, I I think we're about to need it. In fact, let's just go ahead and. Huh? Addicted to alcohol, whatever. Last mistake. <laughs> what did I do? Oh. Assholes. All I wanted was to cross the bridge. I don't have any purified water, but Bunker Hill is right over there. And I'll be able to get some from them. You know, though, hey, this, this loot's pretty see good. See if you had anything worth taking. Did somebody just shoot at me? Grab anything you check it out. Good plan. See if there's anything there. Pick it up. Take anything good. Count on it. Grab that. John Get that. John. Pick that up. Good plan. Uh, uh. Hey. Take that. Can do. See if he had anything worth taking. Grab anything useful. So part of the theme that I have for check it out. Laundry's done. Part of See the theme I have there. for one of the settlements I'm working on is uh, Vault 101 suits and uh, bandanas. Of course, there's only like three people at said settlement, but it's still a matter of importance to me personally. You know, speaking of robots, with you know Glory and Nick Valentine and uh, Ada and all them. I fell down the rabbit hole that is near Automata, and holy shit, that game is amazing. Like, hot damn. I never finished the first one, but this one is so good, it makes me want to go back. I'm just not sure I could stand to go back and play a 360 game. Hmm. I should probably finish up with that, but... Having armorer, I think... No, wait, no. What's that one daylight one? Solar powered, yeah. Dude, strength and endurance, huh? Hmm. That would be pretty useful. It, it would definitely make... Yeah, let's go ahead. I mean, why the fuck not? It'll definitely give me a reason to, uh stay active during the daytime. Ah, I need to go that way. Alright. I'm just gonna grab some food real quick. Do they have any melons here? I don't recall. Nope. Corn and potatoes. Yeah, just had to make sure. As a matter of fact, though, let's go ahead you and... You! Need a place to stay? Grab it before someone else does. Yeah, whatever. I'll take it. Stockton snores. You've been warned. Oh my god. I had to stay uh, a couple of months ago with some friends of my fiancé's. Because we were in, like, uh... I think we were outside of Houston. Yeah. But, uh, long story short, one dude snored literally like a machine gun I mean and I've heard machine guns like I've heard actual factual machine guns go off and this guy sounded like that it was fucking ridiculous so however bad Compton snores unless he snores that bad I think I'll be okay whoa what the fuck are you I have never seen one of those before Holy shit! What the? F That's a pretty cool helmet, though. All right. 
right time to go meet old man Stockton. Eh, I know where the hell he is. I'm not listening to that damn tape. But yeah, near, fucking amazing, beautiful, beautiful soundtrack, and of course, absolutely tragic story. I haven't finished it yet, but I already know the story is going to be ridiculously tragic. If it's anything like near or Drakengard, it's gonna, yeah, it's gonna make you cry. Yo, Deb. Excuse me. Stuff. I fixed up most of what's here myself, so. I've got a few minutes to browse. Everything is sold as is. All right, what you got? Oh yeah, I forgot she's got this shit. What do I have as a chess piece? Hmm, I think I want that. As well, huh, as well as this. See, that's right, yeah, right leg. Yeah. Action point, refresh speed versus movement speed. Uh, I'm gonna stick with what I got now. In the meantime, why don't you have some, I don't have nearly enough jet to cover that. However, I do still have plenty of caps. So let's go ahead and put that on. Damn, it's, all, it's better out of the box. Quartz, synth, um, synth armor don't seem to be all that great, and I, I used to know exactly which one was the best at what, but, uh, synth armor is kind of a hybrid. Welcome, my friend. Might I ask, do you have a Geiger counter? Mine is in the shop. You? I was expecting someone of the, uh, feminine persuasion. You're with our mutual friends. Yes? Let's say I am. Of course. You've just joined, haven't you? All you need to know is this is the first stop for all our new packages. So maintaining proper security here and preventing any unnecessary delays is crucial. Mm-hmm. A trader always has to move his merchandise sufficiently. You wouldn't want any hiccups in the supply chain. Exactly. My current package has been in my possession far too long. I'm supposed to deliver the package to some place nearby, but raiders have complicated matters. So, if you could... Facilitate delivery. I can do that. We're supposed to make the delivery at night, so once you clear out the undesirables, we'll meet after the sun sets. All right. I'm sure there'll be some alcohol in there. Where am I going? No, not far. Not far at all. Of course, I'm sober now. And I'm also in withdrawal, so I'm actually suffering a little bit. Let's see if I've got any more booze. I do not. And that's the one great thing about this one good thing. Let me put it th put it that way about joining, you know, the Raiders and the uh, well, the Raider DLC is that you can make your own alcohol. Of course, any other time you could just, you know, hire a merchant and buy alcohol. Do nothing. Nothing. Whoa. <laughs> There's a much bigger problem out there. She's down. So I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna try not to die. Ah uh, shit. I still don't have any water. Alright, let's 
What? Okay, what the fuck is up with these uh, robots with names? I got Doomguard fucking Bot Alpha, or whatever the hell his name was. Sentry Bot Lament. I mean, what the hell is next? The, the, the twin, you know, I bots of regret and pain? Eesh. I need to find a place to sleep anyways. Pass the time. So, I'm gonna run over here to this other outpost I've created. Sleep there and then head on back. And in the meantime, I'm going to hope and pray that uh, the place has done what I needed it to do, which is pretty much provide some added guns to murder whatever spawns up here that's going to try to kill me as I go by. You know how it's always a battle between the Brotherhood and the Railroad and Raiders or, or Mutants or whatever. Yeah, there it is. I'm pretty sure I got a supply line connected to this place. No defensive emplacements. I think I was still out of aluminum. There we go. Oil. Of all the shit to not have, oil. Motherfucking kidding me. Alright, let's just, uh, let's dump this ammo in here. Hey! Hey, over here. This is my excuse for a settlement. Like, Heads from up. the ground up, a I'm settlement. Listening. Heads up. Let's take some of that combat armor and give it to this person. Yo, on your feet. Seems to be growing well. Ain't looking for trouble, I hope. I want to trade a few things. Sure. Like, are you really giving me this crap about trouble? Oh no, I decided they were all going to be, you know, metal cowboy vault dwellers. Because that makes perfect sense. So let's store that. And, uh... You know, let's store that too for... Oh, I, I intended really for the only be like two or three people here. But, uh... You know, the whole purpose... Was just for them to add... You couldn't just crash. I want your damn armor. Just... Just get wrecked already. Whoop. 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 Hmm. Bitches. Ooh. Uh, yeah, they're over there doing their thing. Oh, wow. Well, thanks, guys. I mean, no complaints here. No mercy. However, I still need fucking oil. And right now, I don't know where I'm going to get any. And I'm also getting distracted because that is not why I came here. Although... She's only producing one food. Oh, that's because there's... Gotcha. The, uh, mute fruit... Mute fruit tree counts as one. So, how about some corn while we're at it? And you know what else? Uh... 
a chemistry station. Which one is better, this one or this one? Yeah, this one takes less stuff. But let's make one of these. Just gonna sit it here. And are you fucking kidding me? I don't have any acid, no bones. Ah, oh, Alex, you are a failure of the highest regard. Shit. I slept too long. Let's get down there and meet Elder Maxim. Or, not Ma- Damn it. Stockton. Compton. Whatever the fuck his name is. Let's get down there and meet the dude. You know, if I was smart, I would have tagged oil for search. Ah, oh, well. One of these days, I'll actually be good at this game. But until then, I will continue to fail in a most spectacular fashion. kidding me. Nope. Nope. Fuck him. What happened? No. Caps lock. What the hell? Am I over encumbered? Oh, then what the hell? Fucking caps lock. <clears throat> Everything looks clear. This is H222. H2. Here's the person I talked to you about. Nice to meet you, H2. Another person actually happy to meet me. This'll take some getting used to. Remember what I told you, H2. I'll fire up the signal. Okay. While you're doing that... Ah. Uh... And... Time for me to go. Keep H2 safe. Someone will be here shortly. We're just gonna sit out here and wait for death to come. Yo. Easy there. Don't shoot. Professor, right? I heard about you. Walked the Freedom Trail, cleared our switchboard. Glad you joined the team. Do you have a Geiger counter? Right you are. Mine is in the shop. All good? Now, let's take a look at our friend. Hey, you... you okay? A little rattled, but I've never been better. The other man, he said I shouldn't talk too much. He told you right, H2. You'll need a real name and a new face, but we'll get to that. Oh, listen. There's more than raiders behind me. Afraid we need a little more help. Lovely. What type of help? We need to get to Ticonderoga's safe house, my home. A lot of sense fresh off the boat crashed there until we smuggled him out of the Commonwealth. All right, Ticonderoga, here we come. I'll lead the way. Then lead the way. Hey, H2. From what I've been told, it's probably safer if I don't say anything. I don't want to put you in any more danger. Would you at least like a gun? Yo, high rise. We can catch up at Tycon. We just got to make it there alive first. Then go. Please. I'm begging you. Go. Ugh. So MG. And we're creeping. And we're creeping along. Yo, guys, come on. Are we really gonna do this? 
This quest is gonna take 45 fucking hours at this rate. <sighs> oh my gosh, why? Why? Damn it, we were doing so good. You know what? While you do your shit, I'm gonna go fucking kill something. Oh. Whew, wow. I almost got way in over my head. Excellent. I am gonna soup that weapon up. Shut up, Preston. Cause I mean, he does sound like Preston. Fellas? Whoop. You're tough. Come on. What, really? Oh, thanks, Nick. My heavily armed robot companion. All right, you gonna come? You gonna go? You gonna do something? Bro, come on. Come on. Apparently it takes a pair of nuts on the back of this dude's neck to get him moving. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's our destination anyways. That tire just flipped the fuck out. Here we are. Oh, maybe it's not that place. Maybe it's this place. I don't even know anymore. I saw those red lines and I instantly thought they were claymores. I guess I'm missing Metal Gear. Mm hmm. Hey, hi, Rice. And we're here. All in a night's work for you agent types. Huh. Just part of the service. I think I'm gonna like you even more than Glory. If you ever need grub, bullets, or just a power nap, take the elevator up to Tycon. My house is yours. But right now, I need to take care of H2. Later. So, uh, let's go ahead and go up here because one, there's something valuable up here. Two, well, let's just hope it doesn't crash or glitch out. Yay, we're here. No errors, no miss. We'll secure the area. Seems awful risky hiding out on the top floor of a skyscraper. Shut up, Nick. High Rise runs a good safe house. No accountant for taste. Thanks again. Commonwealth will be safe at night. Hey, that has gears. Gears are surprisingly rare on this playthrough. So, if I see them, they're coming with me. That's. Yeah, I'm gonna take that too. And that. And there's. I'll take that. 
But other than those things, there's not really anything that I super duper need. For the railroads never oh my gosh, get out of the way. Let's see about this way. I, I know there's something here. There's like a one of the few magazine or safe. something. I, at, at least I thought nice there was. Job of H2. I'm just gonna poke around a bit. Yeah. You're from HQ, right? No. I'm just some guy off the street. Which is actually more true than saying I am from HQ. This way. Ooh. You know. It very well could be one of those things that I can only do during a specific quest line. Because those things exist. That being said, I'm gonna still keep on searching. I must. Uh, uh. Guess I rolled a one in grammar today. Still, further down we go. Jeez, this place is pretty damn extensive. But hey, there's a lot of shit here. A lot of shit. And I'm just fucking looting this place. Picking it clean. All right, if there's a uh, skill book or something, I honestly don't think it's down here because I'm not sure I've ever been down here. Of course, somebody who has been paying avid attention to my entire series is going to tell me that I'm wrong, that I have been here and, you know, whatever. Hello, what's this? Terminal somewhere. That'd be Michael hilarious Hayes if it was full of here. ghouls. Probably so folks couldn't run. I have no idea what he did. Oh, ground floor. Long way down. I know it's up there though.
Whoa! Tycon's one of the few places I feel safe. So, again, pretty sure. Seems awful risky hiding out on the top floor of a skyscraper. Oh God! Shut up. You're from HQ, right? Jump. Let's just go up. I'm pretty sure it's up. It's always up. Safe house. Thanks again. The Commonwealth ain't safe at night. Wait. Okay. Camp station on one side. Other thing. Hey, there it is. Mr. Stockton. Nice. Said I shouldn't say anything. And I'm saying you should uh, shut up. Hey, that was a flip lighter. Flip lighter is gonna have oil. Oil means I can build a thing. A turret. It's gonna come in super handy at some go. point in the future. So, let's get on back across the river here. That is not a way across. Thank you. Oh no, you're not done. Break a sweat. Not that it's an option. Haha. Indeed it is not an option. Still don't know where that damn robot is. But I can tell you there's raiders over that way. Who's there? And since I don't remember where the back entrance is, I guess we're taking the front door. Sorry, I had to charge my phone in. Now then, let's just dash through these tunnels real quick. Oh, did you guys know that Fallout VR is a thing? Like, it requires an HTC Vive or, or something like that, but holy shit, I would love to play this in full VR, but I do not have the hardware. Like, I just don't. I'm sorry. The H222 situation appears to have been resolved satisfactorily, but there's yet more to be done. Since the fall of the switchboard, we've ascertained the fate of all but two safe houses. I want you to check on Augusta. Whatever. I'll get it done. Details await at the dead drop. Have a care. Odds are very good you're walking into something nasty. When is it ever anything else? Can you build me a mansion? Casa del D. Can you shut the hell up? I don't I don't need that thing. It's Are gonna do injured? me more as scrap. It's a wonder However, don't... let's go talk to Pam well, real quick. Right. See if uh, see if things are progressing with her. Confirmed. 
Agent Professor has arrived. I have a mission for you. Yay. Without increasing efficiency of synth traffic flow, odds of entire organization being compromised increase daily. Solution. A new distribution center needs to be established. I get to set up a new base. That's cool. Agent's temperature is irrelevant to this conversation. Mission details commencing. Pacify the target location. Fortify position to protect current and future railroad assets. New distribution center will be codenamed Mercer Safe House. Good luck. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, though. Oh, Croup Manor. Lovely. Alright, so I guess I will be headed there in the future, but for now, I guess that'll wrap things up. So, uh, if you guys enjoy the video, please like and subscribe. Be sure to leave me a comment and tune in next time where, well, I get into some more fucking trouble. So, uh, thanks for tuning in, you guys. I will see you next time.